Mr. Warren, you so funny. You crazy, man. <laughs> oh, you talking all sorts of smack. Let, let's, let me see if I can break this down for you. First of all, the Caucasian police. Yes, I am officially a DNA Caucasian. But you see, when I was a child, I was adopted by a black family. I'm a, an official brother. That's right. I've been pimping since I was born. <laughs> Naya, you talk about some sort of imposter for charade? <laughs> what you talk about, honky? In your wet dreams. You see, you can believe what you want. But that sweet taste in your mouth after you kiss her? Yeah, that's my DNA, boy. <laughs> Smell that sweet poontang. Smell like kabasi egg. Well, it is, cuz I drink it out of a little honey pot. <laughs> Oh, my goodness. Love you, Charade. I think Charade's tired of that strap on that you keep your little hot little hands all over all the time. She wants and needs my beef injection. But let me ask you. Why do you talk to the, to the strap on, Mr. Warren? I, is it because your Jimmy don't, don't talk back to you anymore? Has your Jimmy left you? Has your Jimmy left you? Hang it. <laughs> Oops, did I say that? <laughs> you so crazy. But anyway, all this talk of blood makes me want to give you and all of that brutal impact monkeys a tampon pile right anywhere you're bleeding. I'm watching you. <laughs> Biding my time. And pretty soon, Mr. One, it's going to be double penetration time. Caucasian police. You best know I got your number. And my number, in case you wanted, is 666. Six, six. <laughs> Do you with it? <laughs> <laughs>